Holy How you on the water pipe? Holy man! From the depths of the oceans to the animals in the wild, there are so many shocking, bizarre, and even utterly dangerous creatures which are yet to be discovered and studied. Follow along while we unveil the truth behind these ghoulish animals. Largest Land Crab This animal is the stuff of nightmares, especially when I saw it crumpling that metal cap. It gave me chills. Imagine a human hand in that. This was a coconut crab, the largest land-dwelling crustacean on Earth. You will find them roaming here and there on the small island of Zanzibar. It walks really fast, likes to climb trees, feeds on birds, and loves to break coconuts with its powerful strike. Thus the name, coconut crab. Though 40 centimeters in length, the span of its legs can be up to one meter in length. Dragonfish. Scientists caught this bizarre fish, which usually lives a thousand meters deep in the water and is just 10 centimeters long. But why are they sending this ultra rare fish back to the ocean? To see how it glows, yeah. Meet the dragonfish, which glows underwater through a process called bioluminescence, in which the light is produced by its organs called photophores. And not just that, the fish, when reaching its normal pressure in the ocean, this tiny fish becomes really fearsome. Look how it opens its jaws underwater, just like a dragon. Smallest Demogorgon a man was walking on the beach when he noticed a creepy creature crawling near the shore. When he came near, he realized that despite being a single creature, it had more than one head, and all of them were eyeless, which made it look a lot more creepier, and the teeth were sharp enough to give anyone a nasty bite. When the video was uploaded, people started calling it the tiniest monster alive. Actually, it was not a monster, but a kind of eel known as a worm goby. Even with such a disastrous appearance, such eels are not of any harm to their surroundings. Damascus Goat Known as the bulldog of goats, this is the Damascus Goat, which goes from being the cutest goat to the most monstrous one in the span of months. They are one of the native goats of Syria, and they are the result of years of crossbreeding between the boar and Sirohi goats. They are born with long ears and have a relatively small face compared to their enormous bodies. They provide milk, and their skin is commonly used for the production of fine leather. And even though they are present in large numbers in Syria, such goats are still considered alien goats in other parts of the world. Gazillion Arms it's not just the depths of the ocean which we have not explored yet, but the surface of the ocean too, which surprises us almost every day. Just like this, when something was stuck on a fisherman's hook, and he thought that he was about to get a big catch. When he took it out of the water, the fisherman was surprised to see that it was not a fish, but a weird creature with lots of arms. Because he had never seen a creature like this before, he uploaded its video, calling it the alien of the ocean world. Actually, it was a basket star. They're basically a group of brittle stars and are distant relatives of starfish. Probably the reason why they have so many creepy arms. Fruit Bat A man thought of it as a prop and went to grab it when it showed some movement. That's when he realized that it's not a prop, but a real life bat. It was actually a fruit bat, also known as flying fox usually found in Asia and Europe. And while these bats may seem pretty wild, they're actually calm, as they totally rely on fruits and nectar. But they might attack you if they feel a little defensive, and they do carry germs. So you should be a little careful about touching these giant creatures. Black Blob A man posted this video online asking the internet community to figure out what he caught resting on the rocks on the St. Lucia beach. It seemed like it was not a single creature, but the blob was made up by so many greasy worms intertwined with each other. So the guy intentionally started stabbing the blob with the aim to find out what it really was, but nothing was helping. They were actually bootlace worms that were attached together. 
Boat lace worms are one of the longest worms in the world. The fact that these worms kept joining together, regardless of the man's effort, was probably because, just like crabs who are boiled alive, they don't have a brain, and therefore do not feel pain either. F. Octopus A mysterious octo-shaped creature with its mouth wide open was caught on the fishing hook and shocked the fisherman. At first, he thought of it as some kind of an octopus stuck in the fishing hook, but after he pulled it out over onto the boat, the fisherman realized that it was not an octopus, as it only had three tentacles instead of eight. Then what was it really? It was a weird, bulbous-looking creature which had its mouth wide open. And the more he tried to explore it, the more mysterious the creature was becoming. So he unhooked its jaw and threw the animal back in the ocean, so it might not cause any danger to them. Frogfish this man caught a weird fish, the fish which swims slower than any other fish. And because they lack the swim bladders, the fish can walk using their fins. It really does. That's not all. They can force water using their gills, which gives them a jet-like speed, so they can escape faster if needed. Found in the shallow waters, their distinct features make them one of their kind. Though they are considered to be harmless fish, some toadfish are so dangerous that a slight touch can spread their venom to your body. Budget's Frog Imagine keeping a pet which never lets you come near it and screams whenever you try to! Now imagine it being a frog. Yes, a screaming frog! Also known as a Budget's Frog, the reason behind its shrieky voice is danger. Whenever he senses it, which is mostly when someone tries to come near it, he starts grating. But despite its squeaky voice, which is enough to make you deaf if you keep hearing it every day, he's a celebrity of the frog world because of its comical head, which is so large that it's literally half the size of the frog's body. Spice Bush Caterpillar A man was mowing his lawn when he came across a strange creature. It had two tiny black eyes and was crawling like a snake, but was way too small for it. Then what was it? Well, definitely not a snake, but it sure acted like one. When the man started stroking its back and was acting like a predator to see the little creeper's reaction, it elevated its head and used its snake-like tongue to scare him off. It is a common practice used by such caterpillars in which they mimic snakes to avoid predation. Lizardfish When a fisherman caught a strange fish from the ocean, he instantly realized that it's more than what he could imagine. So he handed it over to the marine biologists. And guess what? He was right! It was no ordinary fish, but a rare species commonly known as a lizardfish. She was more than 25 inches long, and was given the name because of its lizard-like body and a single bite from its wide mouth and sharp teeth would be enough for prey. And with a fish like this, it would be a shame for the fish to use its jaws. She just swallows it, like this. But because her natural habitat is 700 to 3500 meters deep in the ocean, how she made it to the surface is still a mystery. Black Swallower Living a thousand meters deep in the ocean brings its consequences, as the food available there is scarce. Therefore, the competition to the fish living there is hard. Either you swallow the available food, or you give it away. There's no time to chew it. Such a situation makes the swallower fish. Don't judge it by its size, as this fish can literally eat up anything, even if it's twice its size, just like this. When it was put in the aquarium with other fish, it, um, well, you better watch it. Fish Whisperer A rare fish washes along the flood water near this woman's house in India, so she uploads its video on the internet and it instantly goes viral, but for all the wrong reasons, because hundreds of people started telling her to either kill it or throw the fish away. But why? Well, let me tell you because it was a sucker mouth fish called by this name, because of its sucker-like mouth, which allows it to adhere to the surface. Sucker fish are considered to be one of the most dangerous fish as they feed on fish eggs and algaes, therefore contain hundreds of viruses inside them. 
they usually live in streams and rivers, but can survive without water for more than 24 hours. Crawling bird. Hairy caterpillar or a bird? What is this? Actually, it's both. Not really, but it pretends so good to be both. It is a bird known as a cinerous mourner, and when its babies are born, they have a hairy skin just like caterpillars. And what they do with their caterpillar-like skin is quite interesting. They mimic them. Because there are so many predators present for these little babies, the only defense they've got is to be what they resemble. So they creep like caterpillars. I mean, they literally become the hairy caterpillars known as woolly bears to avoid predation. Centipede and Mouse This man found the centipede crawling on his window and decided to pet it, then decided to put it in the same cage where he kept his mouse. And the rest is history, because when the rat mistakenly went near the centipede, he attacked it, not just one time. The vicious worm attacked the mouse several times, paralyzing it completely. And when the rat almost surrendered, the centipede leapt on him and started munching on the poor creature's head. Well, it is what they do normally because their venom can completely damage the neural activity of the prey, which helps them in fulfilling their needs. Black Slug Just when they were out fishing, this family discovered a slimy creature walking at the surface of the water. It had, well, whatever he had was not quite detectable. But let's just focus on the most visible things. It had two ears and a mouth. And, well, yeah, that's it. But the face is not all that they lack. Sea slugs are brainless. They really don't have a brain. But despite all these flaws, sea slugs are still important, and they have a wide scope in the medical world and can be useful in defeating dementia. Red-Faced Monkey This guy decided to get some fresh air when he noticed a monkey sitting on his balcony. This was definitely not the primate American monkey, as it had some weird features, and its bald head, red face, and short tail were enough to make it distinct from the others. And even with all these bizarre qualities, the monkey was just the size of a house cat. The thing which was even stranger was that they normally live in Amazon forests and are not too often seen in the urban areas. This one probably lost his way, so the guy decided to rescue the little monkey and sent it to the Amazon Animal Orphanage. Sea Mouse This is a sea mouse. Now imagine if our house mouse had the same appearance. Would you still adore them? Known as a sea mouse, creep like snails but are actually worms. They possess quite strange characteristics. These marine worms live in the deep sea waters and spend most of their time hiding in the sand floor, which makes them rare, and it is so hard to spot one near the shore. Though it seems like they don't have a face, they actually do, and are really active worm predators in the sea. They usually hunt on crabs and other smaller worms, but they are still one of the creepiest mice ever. Stag Beetle the guy was hiking in the woods when he spotted a two-inch long giant beetle resting on one of the trees, and his first instinct was to hold it. But that wasn't a very good decision, because as soon as the guy held it, the giant beetle pinched him on the hand. And why shouldn't it? It's the only thing these beetles know. Luckily, the beetle was not a female, because a single bite from a female is so powerful that it will be enough to break anyone's skin. Gordian Worm A farmer spotted this bizarre creature in his farm while he was watering his plants. It was a horsehair worm, given the name because of its skinny body, and they are really the size of a horse's hair. They usually live in small ponds and swimming pools. You might not have seen them because they are hard to find due to their thin body, and they can become a nuisance when you spot not one, but their whole family living in your backyard. Though they seem harmless, they can become dangerous during an attack, just like this one who was literally feasting on the poor mantis. Fleshy Creature Though plenty of strange creatures wash up on the beaches of Thailand every day, when a beachgoer spotted this utterly bizarre creature, it shocked everyone. Just when he was about to pick it up, thinking it was some kind of trash washed out of the ocean, Moving closer, he realized that the trash, I mean creature, was moving. 
It kind of looked like a rare jellyfish, so the guy tried to identify it by poking its body, which apparently did not help him. The only thing he got to know was that it had hundreds of hairy tentacles, which were attached to its slimy body. Octo Girl. Imagine coming across the tiniest octopus in the world. Now imagine the octopus biting you. It'll hurt a little bit, right? Well, you're absolutely wrong, as a single bite from this octopus can kill you in minutes. When the girl grabbed it in her hands, she had no idea what this might be able to do to her, because this is the blue ringed octopus, the smallest yet the most dangerous one alive. It's so powerful that a single sting would be enough to paralyze you, and the venom its bite contains can make not one, not two, but 26 people dead instantly. Bloated Fish After the 2011 tsunami in Japan, strange creatures started washing up on the beach, just like this one. When the onlookers spotted this bizarre creature, they could not decide what it was or where it came from. Therefore, when the video was uploaded, it divided the internet, with some people suggesting that it might be a whale or a giant squid that was just stranded on the beach due to high tides. But the others believed that it was surely a never-seen-before creature. Since today, the origins of this giant bloated fish are still not discovered. Mud Crab This man literally shoved himself into the mud. Using a crab hook is illegal in Queensland, Australia, so he dug up a hole in the mud and decided to go inside it. Even though it was a risky task what he was doing, his efforts were not fully wasted, as he came out holding a giant mud crab in his hands. It is the largest species of the swimmer crab and can reach the length of 15 to 20 centimeters and can weigh almost 3 kilograms. The crab was so huge, it was twice the size of the man's face but he was lucky as he kept the giant pincers of the crab out of his face. Hagfish A man encountered what has to be the most disgusting animal of the ocean world. Often referred to as an eel, but not actually an eel, it's really a fish. Yep, a fish without fins that lives 5,500 feet deep in the water. It literally has no face and attacks its prey with the help of four little sensory tentacles surrounding their mouths. And once they find it, which is usually a carcass, they dive into it with their heads, making a tunnel to feed on the flesh. And once they've eaten, they can survive months without another meal. Monkfish the Russian diver caught a giant fish, and when he was trying to feed the fish, it suddenly grabbed the man's hand and clamped its jaws around it. Well, it was not the first time the fish had tried to do this, but there have been many cases where they tried to bite the hands feeding them, which proves that these fish can be pretty aggressive when they're out of water, and they use their natural weapon to attack the prey. Monkfish are so big, but have even bigger mouths, which helps them in hunting down prey in the deep ocean. But for the fishermen, the gaping jaws are just obstacles, because these fish are only harvested for their fins, which are totally opposite to their nature. I mean, they are sweet. Black Hair When a woman was paddling her boat, something got stuck to one of the paddles. When she rolled it over, it turned out to be a sea hare, probably the smallest one there. But touching them is never an option, because even if they look small, they should always be treated like wild animals as they are, as they contain poisonous ink which they might release if they feel defensive. This man had no idea what was waiting for him in the Christmas island of the Indian Ocean. You got it right, it was a coconut crab, but not just one or two. The guy had stumbled upon a cluster of them on the island. But instead of being scared, the man fearlessly grabbed the crab in his hands and started posing with it. But little did he know that he's holding the world's most dangerous crab in his hands. Coconut crabs have giant pincers, which are the most powerful in the animal kingdom. But the boy got lucky as they are afraid of humans and don't usually attack us. Even though they kept their distance, they are just crabs which can be aggressive without letting us know. Thank you very much for watching the video. Do like and share it with your friends. 
subscribe to the channel, and hit the bell icon to not miss any of the upcoming amazing videos. Thank you once again!